Good morning, beautiful people. It's 7.42 on Tuesday, the 10th of August. Today is our final day on the Anglesey Coastal Path, just uh, packing up all my stuff. Uh, there's Alex's tent right there. So we're gonna pack up, have some breakfast, make a move. So this is a bit boring because we walked a mile and a half out to find a campsite. So we are now walking a mile and a half back to Triada Bay along a road. Dun, dun, dun. This is Triada Bay. And we are back on the coastal path, heading towards that big old mountain, the stack. I'm so tired. Like this is a fi final push. <laughs> oh, this is not really that elegant. Oh, creak. We're just checking our geography. <laughs> We're like, is that the Irish Sea? We're pretty sure it's the Irish Sea. So we are next to the Irish Sea here. And then I don't know in the distance, you can see that little island that has got the lighthouse on, which is known as South Stack. So um, that's sort of our next goal before we head round the corner, climb that beast of a mountain there. Not really a beast, 400 feet. <laughs> hill. Hill, mole hill, and then straight on to Holly Head to where we started. Oh my goodness. Nine days ago now. Wowzers. So we're making our way up sort of the climb, which is on a road, quite a narrow road actually. But all the cars are being very respectful, which is appreciated. So we've got about a mile quite steady heading up where we'll be able to look down on South Stack, which is the lighthouse which we saw when we were walking from over there. So it's just sort of over the other side of this hill. Back on the coast back with the beautiful gorse, no, back with the waves crack. Oh, look at a little bench. Oh, that's pretty. We might just have a sit. Oh, oh, that's really nice. So we're actually going to head down to South Stack, which is just there, because we can walk up there and just, it's, I think it's only about three or four switchbacks, so doesn't, I'm saying this now, it doesn't look that bad. Um, I'm hoping it's not that bad, uh, but you know, we're here, we might as well go uh, check it out and see what it's like. So we've reached the entrance and there is a big old, oh, sorry is closed and it also looks like we've got to buy tickets from the visitor center which is way back there so we're currently at south stack which are, you are here so anglesey this is holly head that's where we started and we're currently on this side of the island here and that is south stack We're on the final four miles now to Hollyhead and the sun has come out and it's so glorious. And in the distance, hopefully down there on the right hand side, you can see the big tower, which we've been sort of looking at for quite, well, since we ever came up on the, on the west coast, basically. About the last three days. Yeah. 
One of the quite challenging aspects of it is a lot of the markers are no longer here. So the markers have gone. So sometimes you've got like paths here and paths here. So which one do you take? Down, having a little rest. The time is uh, 20 to 2, and just looking down there is Almost finished the complete loop, just a few more miles to go. So you can probably see Alex in blue, she's climbing down there, and we're going to basically head down these trails and then join up with that one, which will then hug the coastline all the way around to Hollyhead. So, yes final last couple of miles. I didn't actually expect there to be this many uphills and downhills, but it's been absolutely beautiful. A lot busier on this side as well, a much, lot more people, probably because it's so close to Hollyhead, but absolutely stunning. Check out those views. The church. We've actually got to go right through the door. To the front. Oh. Almost done. Woo! Done, done, done. <laughs> How are you feeling, Alex? Hot. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> it's been a it's been a tough little push, but oh, we've done it. This is so awesome. We have literally gone all the way round. Anglesey Island. Yeah. Pop. Done.